What does it feel like going into you know the final season of the show? Well, bittersweet's an overused word because I tell you what, uh, Bob said it best. I think we checked all the boxes. We did everything. We became friends. We were on the high desert in the middle of the night. Uh, you know, we rescued dogs. We made this show. Uh, we got angry with one another. We got loved with one another. You know, it's, there's no stone unturned on what we've done. And in that respect, we can say job well done. Uh, but in the same respect, it's like the last year of uh, last week of high school, where you're like, oh no, oh no, I'm not going to see you anymore. Come, come see me, right? And the fact of the matter is, we're going to see each other. But this moment in time is done, and the lives will splinter off and do what they do. So I can't have asked for a better seven years with a better bunch of people. There's no way around it. And the fact that it's been so critically embraced and, and the fact that the fans have loved it so much has been like a real career capstone. I may do something better in my life, but if I don't, I'm certainly happy with what I got right now. That's amazing. So what's been your favorite thing about playing this character in particular? Oh my gosh, first thing that comes to my head, the suits. Have you seen my suits? Are you kidding me? Those suits are so fantastic. They're by De Stefano of Italy. They make them here in downtown Los Angeles. I'm sorry, that's where they measure me. They make them in Genoa, Italy, to fit my body. And no, no, they don't let me keep them. That's the tragedy of the whole Better Call Saul story. <laughs> Okay, and I have one more question for you. One of your earliest roles was on Saved by the Bell, The College Years. Yes. I'm wondering if you see any potential for reprising your role as Professor Lasky in the reboot, and if you would be willing. Wow, well, I guess um, an actor is always willing, but here's the thing. If you recall Professor Lasky from Saved by the Bell, The College Years, he had some of the most beautiful hair I mean, it was like Sean Cassidy level hair for anybody who knows that that means. I mean, you know. So I don't know if if I could go back with this. You know what I'm saying? This is more like Malcolm McDowell area now. I'm moving into a different direction. So I don't know. If you have a connection, you know, give him a shot over the bow. Maybe. Let's hope. Thank you so much. That's great. Thanks.